Have you ever wondered about the invisible life forms living within us that contribute to our health and well-being? Yes, you heard it right. We are not alone. We share our bodies with a diverse and dynamic community of microorganisms that are so tiny, they're invisible to the naked eye. These microscopic life forms, known collectively as our microflora, are our silent partners, playing an essential role in our health and well-being. Each of us is a bustling metropolis of microbes, home to an estimated 100 trillion microbial cells. To put that into perspective, that's about 10 times the number of human cells that make up our bodies. These microbial citizens inhabit every corner of our bodies, from the skin that covers us to the depths of our gut. They're as much a part of us as our own cells, so integral to our existence that without them, we wouldn't be who we are today. But who are these invisible companions? They come in all shapes and sizes from bacteria and viruses to fungi and protists. These microscopic life forms are not just passive residents, they're active participants in our bodily functions, helping us digest food, synthesize vital nutrients, strengthen our immune system, and even influence our mood and behavior. Our relationship with our microflora is a delicate balance. When in harmony, they contribute to our health, helping maintain our body's equilibrium. But when this balance is disrupted, it can lead to health issues, highlighting the crucial role these tiny organisms play in our overall health. Despite their minuscule size, these microbes have a massive impact. There are invisible allies working behind the scenes often going unnoticed until something goes awry, yet their presence is vital, as they play a significant part in our body's day-to-day -day operations. So let's take a moment to appreciate these microscopic marvels. They may be small, but their influence is mighty. Through their collective actions, they help shape who we are, both as individuals and as a species. So it turns out we are more of an ecosystem than an individual entity. You might be wondering, what exactly is this microflora doing in our bodies? Well, let's delve into that. These microscopic organisms, collectively known as our microflora, carry out a host of critical functions that contribute to our overall health and well-being. Firstly, let's consider digestion. Our bodies are impressive, but they don't have the means to break down every type of food we consume. That's where our microflora steps in. They're like the unsung heroes of our digestive system breaking down complex carbohydrates and proteins into simpler, absorbable units. Some of these friendly microbes even produce essential vitamins like vitamin K and various B vitamins, right in our gut. Imagine that. We have our very own vitamin factory operating non-stop inside us. Now, on to immunity. Our microflora forms a formidable line of defense against harmful microorganisms. By colonizing our gut, these beneficial microbes prevent the bad guys like disease-causing bacteria and viruses from setting up camp. They're like our body's personal security team, always on high alert, ready to ward off potential threats. And it doesn't stop there. Believe it or not, these microorganisms also play a role in our mental health. Recent research has uncovered a fascinating link between our gut microflora and our brain, aptly named the gut-brain axis. Communication along this axis can influence our mood and behavior. Some scientists even go as far as to call our gut our second brain. So what does this all mean? Simply put, our microflora is not just a passive passenger in our bodies. It's an active participant in our health, playing a role in everything from digestion and immunity to our mental well-being. In essence, these tiny organisms are doing big jobs inside us. They're not just along for the ride, they're essential co-pilots on our journey towards health and wellness. So the next time you think about your health, remember to consider these microscopic allies that are working tirelessly within you. So, who exactly are these microscopic tenants in our body? You might be wondering. Well, let's dive in and meet some of them. Our microflora, or microbiota, is composed of a diverse community of microorganisms. This includes bacteria, viruses, fungi, and even some single-celled organisms known as archaea. Each of these groups plays a different role in maintaining the harmony within our body. The bacteria, often the most talked about, are incredibly diverse in themselves. From aiding in digestion to producing vitamins, they're the workhorses of our invisible companions. The viruses, although often seen as harmful, can also play a crucial role. Some, called bacteriophages, even help keep our bacterial populations in check. Then we have the fungi, which while fewer in number are equally important. They help break down complex molecules and keep our immune system on its toes. Last but not least, the archaea, 
these ancient organisms, once thought to only inhabit extreme environments, have been found in our bodies too, playing their part in this intricate ecosystem. Now here's the fascinating part. The composition of our microflora is as diverse as humanity itself. It varies from person to person, and even within different parts of the same person's body. Factors such as diet, environment, age, and genetics can influence this microbial diversity. For instance, a diet rich in fiber can boost the population of bacteria that break down complex carbohydrates. On the other hand, a high-fat diet can favor bacteria that are associated with inflammation. Even our environment, from the air we breathe to the people we live with, can shape our microbial communities. Our genetic makeup also plays a role, as certain genetic factors can influence how our bodies interact with these microorganisms. Some people might have a genetic predisposition that allows certain bacteria to thrive, while others may not. In conclusion, our microflora is a complex and diverse community, constantly interacting and evolving with us. It's a reflection of our lifestyles, our choices, and even our ancestry. Our microflora, it seems, is as unique as we are. But what happens when our microflora is out of balance? Imagine a symphony where every instrument is playing in perfect harmony. Now imagine if one instrument starts playing off-key, the entire symphony is affected. Similarly, our body is a symphony, and our microflora is an integral part of it. When our microflora is out of balance, it affects our entire body, which can lead to various diseases. One of these diseases is obesity. Research has shown that certain bacteria in our gut can influence how we store fat, how we balance levels of glucose in the blood, and how we respond to hormones that make us feel hungry or full. When our gut bacteria is out of balance, these processes can get disrupted, potentially leading to obesity. Diabetes is another disease that's linked to our microflora. An imbalance in our gut bacteria can lead to inflammation and insulin resistance, both of which are key factors in the development of type 2 diabetes. Our microflora also plays a crucial role in our immune system. When it's out of balance, it can trigger an overreaction of the immune system, leading to autoimmune disorders. In these disorders, our immune system mistakenly attacks our own body's cells, mistaking them for harmful invaders. So what disrupts our microflora? One of the key culprits is an unhealthy lifestyle. A diet high in processed foods, lack of physical activity and high stress levels can all disrupt our microflora, leading to health problems. To make matters worse, the use of antibiotics can also disrupt our microflora. While antibiotics are crucial for fighting bacterial infections, they can also wipe out beneficial bacteria in our gut, throwing our microflora off balance. In essence, our microflora is like a delicate ecosystem. When it's in balance, we thrive, but when it's out of balance, it can lead to various health problems. Maintaining a balanced microflora then is key to our overall health. How can we take care of our microflora to ensure they take care of us? Well, it's simpler than you might think. The key is to provide an environment that allows them to thrive and multiply. This means eating a healthy diet, getting regular exercise, and ensuring you get enough sleep. Let's start with diet. Consuming a variety of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins can help nourish your microflora. These foods are high in fiber and other nutrients that your microflora love. In addition, fermented foods such as yogurt, sauerkraut, and kimchi are rich in probiotics, which are beneficial bacteria that can boost your microflora. Regular exercise is another crucial factor. Physical activity can stimulate the growth of beneficial bacteria and help maintain a balanced microflora. It doesn't have to be strenuous, even a brisk walk can do wonders for your microflora. Sleep is also essential. During sleep your body works to repair and rejuvenate and this includes your microflora. Lack of sleep can disrupt this process and lead to an imbalance in your microflora. So, make sure you're getting those 7 to 9 hours each night. Now let's talk about antibiotics. While they're necessary in certain situations, unnecessary use can harm your microflora. Antibiotics kill bacteria indiscriminately, which means they wipe out both harmful and beneficial bacteria. So use them judiciously and only when prescribed by a healthcare professional. Last, but certainly not least, consider incorporating probiotics and prebiotics into your routine. Probiotics are live bacteria and yeast that are good for your health, especially your digestive system. Prebiotics, on the other hand, are types of dietary fiber that feed the friendly bacteria in your gut. Together, they work to promote a healthy and balanced microflora. In other words, a healthy lifestyle is the best way to take care of our microflora. 
So what does the future hold for our understanding of microflora? Well, the horizon is teeming with exciting possibilities. As we delve deeper into the world of microflora, we are beginning to unravel the intricate roles these microscopic organisms play in our health and disease. The potential of microflora research is enormous, and it's becoming increasingly clear that these tiny, invisible companions are far more influential than we ever imagined. In the future, we could see a whole new paradigm in medicine, one where we don't just treat symptoms, but we look at the root cause of diseases. And many of these causes could be traced back to our microflora. It's a fascinating concept, isn't it? That by studying these minute organisms, we could potentially develop new ways to treat, and perhaps even prevent, a range of diseases. Imagine a world where we could predict a person's risk of disease, not just based on their genetics, but also on the composition of their microflora. This could open up avenues for personalized medicine like never before. Each individual's treatment could be tailored to their unique microflora composition, enhancing the effectiveness of therapies and reducing side effects. Moreover, we might be able to manipulate our microflora to improve our well-being. This could be done through diet, lifestyle changes, or even through the use of probiotics and prebiotics. These measures could help us nurture and maintain a healthy microflora and in turn, boost our overall health. But let's not forget that this is a complex field with many unknowns. While we are making strides in understanding our microflora, there is still much to learn. We need to tread carefully, ensuring we conduct rigorous and ethical research. In this era of microbiome research, we stand on the precipice of a new understanding of health and disease, one that recognizes the pivotal role of our microflora. It's an exciting time to be involved in this field, with each new discovery bringing us closer to a future where we can harness the power of our microflora for better health. Indeed, the future of microflora research holds exciting possibilities for our health. In the end, our microflora is an integral part of us that we are just beginning to understand. This invisible community of microorganisms, living harmoniously within us, plays a vital role in our health and well-being. From aiding in digestion and absorption of nutrients to fortifying our immune system, our microflora is truly a hidden hero. We've delved into the complex composition of our microflora and how it can influence disease. It's clear that nurturing our microflora through a balanced diet and lifestyle is essential for maintaining optimal health. The future of microflora research is bright, with potential advancements promising to revolutionize our approach to health and disease. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of our inner microbial world, we learn more about ourselves. As we continue to explore this fascinating world within us, remember, we are not alone in our bodies, and that's a good thing.